there's so much there's so much desire to compete at that that prominent level and you know I've, I've often said that we're, we're nationally known I really I think we are I think Bishop Kelly is nationally known for its success in volleyball I think the number of state championships speaks for itself so there are little girls who are third grade or fifth grade or sixth grade and they they know if they come to Bishop Kelly and make the volleyball team they're gonna win and they're gonna be a part of something successful and that really just it, it breeds it's on itself and so all their lives if you love volleyball and you live in Oklahoma you know Bishop Kelly just two years ago um, a great team Inky on John Akun and, and Claire Kelly and, and a whole host of others and, and we won it interesting thing come kind of after that you know, a lot of people say okay well Inky, Inky's gone you know we're done we're not we're not going to be able to compete and the next year we came back it's not a business it's like a family we we have each other's backs we support each other and it's like really comforting to know that we can talk to each other whenever we need being with your teammates um, throughout the whole season um, you really grow and these girls really do become your best friends, you're with them 24-7, all the time. We have high expectations for ourselves, not only on the volleyball court, but in the classroom and doing our community service. Whatever we're doing, we want to be excellent at that. And, and then, in turn, when you want to be great and you strive for greatness, people will follow you because everybody wants to be a part of something great. I think that there's a misconception out there that once you win, that it's easier to win again. And I would completely disagree with that. That is said by someone who's never won. Um, as someone who has had the opportunity to experience success, it gets harder every time. Because the monkey on your back just gets a little bit heavier each year. We're not number one ranked, at least at this point, in September. Those Edmond schools are very successful. We lost to Owasso, we lost to local schools. Um, but we're going to compete. It's definitely going to take more effort than it has in class. Do you want to be a team that struggles with losing because you're used to winning? Or do you want to be a team that struggles with knowing how to win because you lose all the time?